In July 2022, Porsche's CEO at the time Oliver Bloom announced the brand was working on a second electric SUV in addition to the upcoming Macan EV. The available info suggests that it could be the company's first ever vehicle available with three rows of seats for fitting up to seven passengers. Here's how the model might look. This rendering clearly uses the Macan and spy shots of the Macan EV as a starting point. The design includes an arched nose and a similarly curved roofline. The result is a sleek-looking vehicle, despite its size. If you look through the windows, you can see the third row of seats at the back. There aren't even spy shots of the seven-seat model's development, so there's no way to know for sure what the cabin looks like. Inside the upcoming Macan EV, there's a digital instrument cluster with a view that includes three circular gauges. There's a rectangular infotainment screen on the center stack. A small display on the console is for the HVAC controls. When he announced the vehicle, Bloom said, We plan to add a new luxury, all-electric SUV model to our attractive portfolio. Later, he added, This, new model, will further expand our position in the luxury automotive segment. We are targeting the higher margin segments in particular and aim to tap into new sales opportunities in this way. The seven-seat Porsche crossover reportedly rides on the scalable systems platform, which is specifically for EVs. There are no powertrain specifics available about the model at this time. These underpinnings would reportedly also form the basis of the second-generation Taycan later this decade. Volkswagen Group software development issues are allegedly forcing Porsche to push back the launch of its EVs, which possibly includes the seven-seater. For example, the company delayed the electric Macan until 2024, rather than the original 2023 launch plan. Thanks for watching. Credits to www.motor1.com and Spied Build LLC. Please subscribe my channel for more auto updates.